Right before KSW 89, the last event this year, December, we're in Katowice. And with me, I have Viktor Peszta, who's about to have the, his second performance in this organization against a uh, much um, more difficult opponent, as you said previously, Shimon Bayer. Uh, it's good to have you here. It's good to see you. How do you feel before the second fight for KSW this year? Yeah, I, I feel great. I felt great coming into the first fight. I, f I feel like I'm right where I need to be. I'm, yeah, I'm just I'm just very happy to be here and and to, to compete. And I'm trying not to stress about the fight. I'm like at the point of, of my career when I'm just I used to be always like super stressed about the fight. Now now I'm like just trying to come in there, enjoy enjoy the fight and. Uh, do 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 the best best possible performance. All right, uh, swinging back a little to the past. How do you recall your KSW debut this year? It was a super quick job for you, but what are your sentiments about it right now? If you swing back to the past, what was my sentiment about my first? Yeah, you recall. How do you see this fight now going on? If you're like you, it's post fight and stuff. Yeah, it went it went pretty smooth. Uh, I was I was a little bit nervous before that fight because I had the long I, I had I, I had a, a, the long long layoff I, I I haven't fought over a year before that and I was on, on a losing streak so uh, I wanted to make sure that I will the, the that I will get that win you know and and get back on like with a with a good performance and it did happen so I'm, 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 I was I was very I w it was a relief for me I, w right. I was pretty stressed coming into that fight All right. so was it a reason of you being so active this year that you've been off and you had this uh, loss streak was it a reason for you to be like as active as possible this year yeah a little bit because uh, as I, yeah I had that long layoff and you never know if I'm healthy, I want to keep fighting. You never know if when you get injured, if you get sick or whatever. Fights get cancelled all the time. So I feel like if I, if I'm if I'm if I'm healthy, I just yeah, I just need to be active. All right, uh, we are very happy to have you as active as possible. Probably uh, Liberty is coming too. You said that you, you would love to perform if you're if you're gonna be good after that fight uh, as well. So um, KSW and Czech Republic, it seems to be like closer and closer. Uh, we've, we had the events, we will be having events in the future. Um, what's your opinion about KSW coming into the Czech MMA industry? Is it going well in your opinion? Uh, yeah, I think so. Um, the, 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 the MMA fan base is pretty strong in, in, in Czech Republic right now. So. And, and there, I mean, there is uh, basically there is one one promotion. There's Octagon, so I feel like there there it's good uh, for fans to have more options to to see to see other promotions as well and some, some other high level promotion, even higher level promotions, fighting like having events in Czech Republic and having Czech fighters fighting. So yeah, I think it's great. All right, and the last from me, um, your opinion about your. Upcoming um, opponent on Saturday, Shimon. You said it's a high-level fighter. Anything else? Did you do a very specific research or something? Yeah, well, he's standing right next to me, so okay. I kind of, I kind of have to be. Nice, Just quick you know? opinion. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, of course I did the research. Of course I did, I did my homework. I watched his fights. Um, um, yeah, I'm not gonna tell you what I'm gonna do because I mean I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna punch him in the face. I can, I can, I can tell, tell you that, but. Yeah, I think he's a. I think, I think he's a great fighter, very experienced, very, very seasoned. Definitely knows what he's doing. And as I said before, that's why I'm here. I want to fight. I want to fight the tough guys. You know, I don't want to fight cans. I want to fight. I want to fight the real deals. Yeah, you said you've done your research, and like you said, of course I did. But I have to tell you that uh, recently I come across the approach of fighters that. They don't really do it. Like they don't like to do research on guys. They p prefer to like um, focus on themselves. And I know what I do. I know my worth. Like a lot of mental stuff going on, but not many research. And for me, it's a surprise because now we live in a media like reality. We have all of the tools yeah. that to do the research. And you said you said it like literally. The homework was done. So it's a serious part of a preparation. Why do you think fighters neglect it? Why do they don't want they to do the research I think they don't some of the guys don't do it because it is like little uncomfortable you know you just have to you watch the guy that you're gonna fight and it's like you're like ah. in your head. yeah yeah so I feel like some guys just want to be like com comfortable and just like yeah just focus on themselves but because if you watch if you watch the tape of your opponent you kind of have to like 
engage. You, yeah, 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 yeah. Exactly. You, you, you just, you, you are in, you are mentally in that fight. You know. So, I feel like for some guys, it's like they use it. Uh, yeah, yeah. They just use it as an escape. You know. And and for me, that is part of the reason why I keep watching those tapes. You know, just to make sure that my focus is on the fight you know because Perfect. so I, I did in, in this camp actually I, I, I was like I, I did I told myself every day I'm gonna watch one fight you know and doesn't matter if it's like an old fight if I if I watch the fight 10 times already I'm gonna watch it look for the details you know and get comfortable of like seeing my opponent and like seeing how he moves and just be being comfortable in his presence you know yeah absolutely I just had to add this little fact because I just uh, referred to what you said that obviously you did the research if you want to see Victor against uh, Shimon this Sunday Saturday I'm sorry uh, don't hesitate to watch uh, to turn on via play or kswtv.com so I want you now to invite all the fans Czech ones or international ones to your fight do you want to do it in Czech or in English? yeah in Czech <laughs> Ahoj, zdravím všechny české fanoušky. Doufám, že se budete koukat tuhle sobotu od sedmi, buď to na KSV TV nebo na Vojo. Těším se na vás. Thank you so much, Victor. One more time.